السلام عليكم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وعليكم السلام ورحمة الله وبركاته نيم ستيت اند كويشن بليز ماي نيم از اميرا اند ام كومينج فروم اتلانتا جورجيا سيستر اميرا وات از يور كويشن تونايت ام ذير ار مسلم سيسترز ذات بوت ذير بيكتشرز اون فيسبوك اند ويز ا هيد سكارف اند ذي ستيل كونسيدر ذا حجاب وات ادفايس دو يو جيف فور ذا الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وأشهد أن لا إله إلا الله وحده لا شريك له وأشهد أن محمدا عبده ورسوله Our sister Amira brought up a very very uh, basically sensitive issue that I think a lot of us are not talking about it or maybe a lot of us are afraid to ask about it because it may just limit our Uh, just one more thing which will limit our liberty and freedom. Uh, Facebook is like any other instrument, uh, like TV, like computer, like internet, is how to use it. How to use it. And what kind of communication do you have? And what do you do exactly there? That's what makes it halal and makes it haram. This is in general, system, Sister Amir. But once it comes to sisters placing their pictures and then circulating this around, I'm telling you, my dear sisters, you are then doing wrong once it comes to Facebook. This is right there, a sign that you are using the Facebook in a lawful way. Uh, you don't know what a person will do with that picture. Uh, you don't know who will be looking at this picture. Uh, you don't know uh, what this will invite uh, a sick heart uh, to think of or to do. Why would you do this, my sister? You just cover your hair and place uh, basically um, uh, some sort of a, a good looking, beautiful face uh, with a covered hair yet still very attractive, still invites, still an icon of temptation Or I see sisters sometimes actually uh, not only wearing the scarf, uh, basically, rather, uh, rather uh, not only wearing the scarf, rather they wear a niqab, meaning that they show only their eyes. But if, if you take a look at these eyes, they are very uh, tempting eyes. The way that everything is put together is to get uh, basically you thinking. Uh, in a way about that individual. I warn you sisters, I warn you sisters. إِنَّ الَّذِينَ يُحِبُّونَ أَن تَشِيعَ الْفَاحِشَةُ فِي الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا لَهُمْ عَذَابٌ أَلِيمٌ فِي الدُّنْيَا وَالْآخِرَةِ Look, وَاللَّهُ يَعْلَمُ وَأَنْتُمْ لَا تَعْلَمُونَ Indeed, those who wish for fahisha to be promoted, fahisha here is, uh, could be adultery or could be the introduction to adultery. Uh, we know the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam told us that the eyes commit adultery. قال صلى الله عليه وسلم كما صح في الحديث في صحيح البخاري العين تزني وزناها النظر. The eyes commit adultery and the eyes commit adultery by looking. So the sister who are, uh, the sisters plural, who are booting on that show for people to look at them And they end up committing adultery with their eyes by desiring you, by thinking about you. Uh, I tell you, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala give you a severe warning. Those who promote al-fahisha, those who promote such moral in the society, amongst the Muslim community, amongst the believers, they will have a painful punishment in the world and in the hereafter. And Allah knows, Wallahu ya'lam, and Allah knows what your intention is, and you do not know. For in general, or in brief, uh, Sister Amira, I tell the sisters, do not do this. Just put it blank and move on, but do not place your picture on a Facebook. I warn you, my sisters, this is right there, is a sign that you are abusing and misusing Facebook, and this is gonna have serious consequences and that is why I advise my dear sisters who are watching me right now not to do this. Jazakallah khairan sister Amira.